What's up everyone? Welcome to another Apple Mod video on the FoxTag YouTube channel. This time we talk about how can you change the keyboard on your Apple Watch. So there are a few things we need to get sorted at the beginning. So if you have like really old Apple Watch, something like the Series 3, you know, it's just not going to work and you cannot have a keyboard on this like older Apple Watch, but the newer models most definitely support it. And the way that it works is that the keyboard languages which are added on your iPhone are also reflected on the Apple Watch, right? So in case you want to change the keyboard, for example, you might want to change it to like a French keyboard, which has a different layout. What you need to do is grab the iPhone, which is paired to your Apple Watch, open up the settings and inside of the general section, you need to go to the keyboard and add that language in it, which is going to end result uh, appear on the Apple Watch too. So on the Apple Watch, if you just want to type in some sort of text or you go to any text field, you can switch the languages and keyboard inputs and you might choose a different one, right? So you also have the ability to choose like the scribble mode or dictation. But as I say, the important thing to keep in mind is that it reflects the keyboard settings, which are on the iPhone. So that's all that you need to know about it. I really hope that you found this video helpful. Uh, also, one more thing which I almost forgot about. Well, there are some third-party keyboard apps on the App Store, and you might be wondering about those, right? And those keyboards are, like, okay, like, they seem fine. But the problem is that Apple Watch doesn't allow you to replace your built-in keyboard with a third-party one, just like you can on the iPhone. The Apple Watch keyboard apps only allow you to open them up as a separate application to type your text using that custom third-party keyboard and only copy it and just paste it somewhere else. So it is kind of limited and I don't really like that uh, option, right? So I don't really use it. But that's it from me. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, go ahead and hit the thumbs up, subscribe to this channel, and I'll see you in the next tutorial.